Rob, you set out earlier um, to assess the snow conditions before everyone went skiing today. What did you do? Yep, that's correct. Myself and Tom came across uh, about an hour ago just to poke around at the snow, fresh snow that's fallen in the last uh, 24 hours on the Gritviken track. Um, so basically what we're looking for is uh, a profile of the snow. So we've just wandered up this slope at the back here and uh, taken cross sections with a shovel and poked around to see what the snow's like. Um, and we've got some perfectly uniform fresh powder sitting on top of a rather hard and slightly icy base, but um, it seems very solid. So it's gonna be a good day skiing, I think. So everyone can go out safely? Yeah, everyone can go out safely. We can do two person travel around the track. You have to be careful because there are avalanches in the area. Um, certainly if you look across to Brown, on which the sun has now fallen, there's a few fresh little uh, sloughs coming down the side of there. But if we're careful and we uh, keep an eye out for the conditions, we should be fine and have a good day skiing. And what other precautions do you have when you're coming out for a day skiing? Um, precautions we have, um, we all take avalanche transceivers, which demonstrate here uh, and we all hopefully know how to use them we don't know, do know how to use them we also take uh, I'm not sure if you can see it on there avalanche probe at the side and an avalanche shovel handle and the shovel uh, proper is in my bag so if anyone god forbid is cutting an avalanche we'll use this little guy to find them the probe to uh, locate them under the snow and then uh, shovel to dig them out. Okay, so all set for a good Saturday skiing. Absolutely, yeah. The, the winter has finally come to KP. Tommy on a split board. Oh. 